Hi, hello, who are you? My name is Anna Tinbenz and welcome back to my channel. We are here on a beautiful Saturday trying to get through as many leak code problems as we can in the year and also today because today is Saturday and Saturday is Saturday. Phil! Hey Phil! What are Saturdays for? Sunday and uh, Saturday by name. No, God. no, what else are they for? Saturday. They're f what are, Saturdays are for the... Saturday. No. Anyway. We are here doing question number 82, remove duplicates from assorted list two. We have done a similar one before this. So let's read through this problem together. Um, and uh, the solution today is also gonna be in Python. So given the head of assorted linked list, delete all nodes that have duplicate numbers, leaving only distinct numbers from the original list. Return the linked list sorted as well. Okay, so we have one, two, three, three, four, four, five. One, two, five. Makes sense. So that's that example, one, 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 two, three. Then we just have two, three. The number of <laughs> nodes in the list is in the range of zero to 300. Perfect, perfect. This list is guaranteed to be sorted in ascending order. Nice. Okay, um, let's just go through this one more time. So given the head of a sorted linked list, delete all nodes that have duplicate numbers, leaving only distinct numbers from the original list, return the linked list sorted as well. Okay. Um, So we need to iterate through the linked list. Remove the nodes with the duplicate values. My initial thought is to create a dummy node that basically will just serve as the head of the, the like the new head of the linked list. So like this doesn't have anything when we start, right? But like we need to have something like a dummy in place here so that we could fill it in. Um, which we need to make the dummy next initialized uh, to the head of this and then make the current the dummy. That's just where I think we need to start because this list doesn't ceases to exist without this list. Um, and that seems like the best way to kind of bring bring it over here um but i also so this that also could be a flawed plan and i'm going to explain why in just a second what i'm going to have to do is use pointers that start from dummy if i do that um that increment or decrement based on where we are here i guess it's ascending so incrementing so hmm Given the head of a sorted linked list, delete all the nodes that have a, have duplicate numbers, leaving only distinct numbers from the original list. Okay. So we need the current, we need a current next, and then the value. So using that kind of pointer idea Let's do, let's initialize the dummy and see what happens. Um, Cause that to me is gonna be the path of least resistance. Um, that also will simplify all the edge cases. So, and I said, I'm gonna do dummy next. And that's gonna be equal to the head. Um, and then the current is gonna be equal to the dummy. The dummy, we want it as a list node zero. Um, and that feels like a good place to start. So I guess we only need one pointer that just kind of increments. So can I just say, I'm just gonna say that's current, current pointer, cause there's no left and right. Hmm, so 
Start from the dummy. And, and basically ensure that we have always have the valid previous node to work with. Hmm. Yeah, we're going to need to do like a while if else, because if a duplicate is found, then we identify that value. So let's say, so I need to move some of this stuff out of my, out of my way. Um, while current next, if current next, next and current next val is equal to the current next next val then we that's a duplicate oops value which is the current oops next val So we're just checking to see if the current node has the next node and if the current node's value is equal to the next node's value. So then we'll say while current next and current next val is equal to duplicate value, then current next equals to current next current next next yeah so if a duplicate is found here then the current next value e oh no wait this would be for the duplicate Yeah, because I would identify that duplicate value and then iterate through the next node as the same value, duplicate value, is skipping all of the nodes. So then let's go down here and say else current equals current. This will fix that. Next. Then if no duplicates are found for the current node, we just simply advance. So to the current pointer to the next node, right? That just like works. So we take into account those values. We just keep incrementing until we have to return dummy next. So I think that makes sense. Given the head of the sort of linked list, lead all the nodes that have duplicate numbers, right? So check the current node that has the next node if the current node's value is equal to the next node's value. Okay. If the duplicate is found, then we identify the value of the duplicate, and that's here. I just want to make sure I'm because I my brain is remembers a similar pattern. Okay, then we continue to iterate through here, the duplicate value, then we will skip all the nodes with the duplicate value, and if no duplicates are found, then that's when we advance the current pointer to the next node after processing all of that. That then leaves us with that modified linked list. Um, and that would still be in the order of those values. Like that's the same ascending order. Let's run it and see duplicate. Duplicate is not defined. Whoops. Oh, 
okay. I'm a little skeptical. But I will take it. And let's... I haven't submitted anything for this yet. So let's submit it. Let's see how well this did. Ooh, memory not so good, but runtime. She hot. She hot. At a beating 87% of users in Python. Uh, but memory only beats 38% of users in Python. So we might revisit this one a little bit. Um, I probably could have done the pointer thing a little bit better, if I'm being honest. Oops, I didn't mean to press my spacebar. Um, really? That just submitted it again? Why are we like this? Oh my god, you guys. I can't can't get a break. What? What the hell? I don't know what is happening. How did... How... how you know what? I don't... I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to put this code in the GitHub repo, which is linked down in the video description below. Please make it better, make it worse, have some fun, fork it and clone it, learn something new. I am doing things out of order right now, and uh, we'll see how the next couple leak code problems go as it starts to look like it's about to rain. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.